You wouldn't want to be fighting ghosts in the alleyways of Gaza, would you? It would be a terrifying experience, and I think any you know any Israeli soldier who's who's there is gripped by fear, uh, no matter how hepped up on on you know nationalist sentiment they may be. I mean, the fact is. The Al Qassam brigades have been preparing for this very moment for years. They knew exactly what they were getting into, and they are not afraid of death. Unlike the Israeli soldiers who want to, you know, go home and enjoy their lives, and you know, they think it's going to be some kind of, uh, uh, you know, relatively easy operation because they're technologically superior. What they lack is heart, and this is what Al Qassam has. I mean, we we've all seen the video now of the Al Qassam fighter running up to a tank with his bare hands and placing some kind of small explosive on it. There was another video that came out yesterday um, of the uh, Al Qassam brigades engaging multiple tanks uh, in close combat. And so showing that they've actually destroyed several of these, at least in, in Gaza. So um, the idea that this is going to be some kind of cakewalk for Israel is absolutely false. And I think what's actually happening is that the Israeli military is hiding the number of casualties from the public. So they sure. don't know how many of their soldiers are actually being killed for this doomed uh, war effort. Um, and, and, you know, so they'll, so they'll continue to support it as long as possible in order to extend the political career of Benjamin Netanyahu and cause as much damage as humanly possible. Uh, so I think I think there's going to be a rude awakening at some point for Israeli society about what this war has actually meant. We just saw Trey Yinks, the Fox News uh, correspondent who is embedded with the Israeli military, say that in one attack, 20 Israeli soldiers were killed. Uh, I don't think the Israeli papers are reporting that. So. Um, I wonder what the actual casualties of Israeli soldiers, uh, the, that number is.